So in this module, we're going to discuss reservations. So before you start going ahead and making reservations against your items, you'd first need to go to your settings, company settings, and look up the reservations module. So you can decide what kind of customization you're looking for. The system right now allows you to reserve assets per user or restrict assets reservations to one asset per user. A very commonly used setting is to ensure that there are no reservation date conflicts. And you can also decide this for all of the item types, assets, asset stock, and inventory. Now, let's go to one of the assets over here and see what kind of actions against the reservations module we can take. I'll use the HP 1.5 as an example. So you have the reservation button right over here at the top right corner. As soon as you click on it, the system is going to ask you for some basic information, such as what are the from and to dates. Here we go. Then you select the user to whom you're making out the reservation to, the location to where the items are being shipped to, and if you've enabled signatures at the time of reservations, you'll also get an option to do your signature. And then you just click on reserve. So as soon as you click on reserve, so as soon as you click on reserve, you can go ahead and look at the reservations detail on the calendar over here to see if there are any other reservations happening. 